gonna teach you how to stand up paddle via the internet. When it comes to big wave riding, you gotta be fit. Once your mind's gonna make your body go somewhere, your body's gotta be able to follow. It's gotta be able to survive whatever you're gonna encounter. Uh, my favorite training in the world right now is stand up paddling. It is the best, funnest, most enjoyable exercise I've ever found. It takes every ligament in your body to balance on this board, and then it's all a core workout from there. First, flat water, a lake, a river, anything with no current, no wind, or an ocean like this. Put your paddle under your stomach like that. And then you paddle out into the lake or the river or the ocean. Once you get out there, you go like this. Stay super low, just like this. You got a four point try, the four points of balance, you won't fall over. Then you grab the paddle, hold it right here. And you stand up slowly. You can even start paddling low until you get it. Then you get to this, and you paddle like that, and you switch, it's all even. You keep your feet side by side, almost perfectly parallel, but whatever more comfortable for you, you can have one foot forward, one foot, either one. I prefer to have this one a little bit further forward than the other one. Whatever is comfortable for you at the end of the day is what you need to do. The angle is upward. You would think it would be that way. Common sense would tell you to do it this way, but this is the proper way. This hand stays like this. This hand stays like this. Whatever hands forward stays straight. You just pull. That's all you do. Pull with this arm. Straight, pull with this arm. When you're first learning, you may need to do a little more of this to balance whatever's comfortable. But once you get good, it's all pull, 100% pull. You wanna get the biggest, widest heavy board you can find. You want a 12 foot board, 34 inches wide. And you'll learn like that. Wow, way more strength than you possibly imagined. You don't realize that not only is it balance, it's pure strength. It's, whoa, like unbelievable how difficult that is. Go out there in my walk shorts, my cap, my t-shirt, come in dry if it all goes well. Paddle, keep the board going toward the shore and switch and switch and switch until you start coming on the wave. Once you start entering that wave, you use the paddle, you lean on it turn with it. Only way you can turn these boards is with this. Other than that, good luck. Whatever way you're turning, you put the paddle in. You're gonna do a bottom turn, you're gonna do a cutback, and you need to waist line up, it's all good. There's this whole thing with like short boarders and intermediate people about paddle boarding, like boo, boo. This man has gone into like 10 foot pipe on a paddle board, and I'm like, that's, that's a pussy thing? And I just went out here in a foot and a half, and it worked my ass. Didn't get wet again, darn it. Sir, you have made a believer out of me. And that's the whole key to it. That, that's why I'm so excited to meet you. Is like, here's a guy who actually pushes surfing to another level. I mean, you went Chopu, you went Jaws. Now you're surfing glaciers. It's crazy, man. <laughs> crazy. All in a day's work. Right? I know, right? <laughs> Wetsuit. And the cold water, it's not even that cold here. I, I can go out there in trunks, no problem. Hey, Kevin. Stay tuned. Did he just make fun of my suit? Aw, oh, he called me a pussy because I'm... Oh.